about to get in this helicopter and show you what these things can do. Hey guys, Be Snappy here. I'm here with Grayson from Hunter Valley Helicopters and we've got something super exciting to share with you. It doesn't matter if you're a helicopter pilot or a fixed wing pilot, you've got to see this. G'day Grayson. Hey, how you going? I posted a video on Instagram about a week ago of a helicopter doing a sliding landing and over 160,000 of you watched it. So we've come to Hunter Valley Helicopters and they're going to give us an exclusive demo of one of these sliding landings. Why do you guys actually do a sliding landing? What, like, what's the point of that? So there might be quite a few reasons why we need to do a sliding landing. Uh, one of them would be if we had an engine failure. So it's called an auto rotation. And so if our engine quits, we're going to get the aircraft into auto rotation. Once it's in auto and we're getting close to the ground, we're then yeah. going to flare the helicopter to slow the rate of descent and slow our speed. We're then going to level the machine and let it run onto the ground. Oh, wow. The sliding landing, which you would have seen. Yeah. Um, another reason might be if we have a tar rotor failure or a jam pedal. That's another reason why we might need to do a slide landing. So are these auto rotations one of the scariest things for students to practice? They can be quite scary. The first one or two are a little bit scary, you're a, yeah. bit, uh, a bit tense, but once you do a couple of them, you start to get used to them. The worst part's coming hurtling towards the ground, getting that ground rush, uh, and then slowing up towards the end, yeah. Grayson is actually gonna give us a live demo just for us. All right, so how's this gonna work, Grayson? Well, I'm about to get in this helicopter and show you what these things can do. Exclusive live demo, let's do this. Yeah. 